we moved in about uh, seven years ago. Um, we always had kind of thoughts of renovation, but we kind of wanted to fill the house out first and, and kind of find what was going to work for us. So um, it was always in the back of our minds. And then, you know, we got to a situation where the house wasn't really working for us. Um, so we kind of um, thought it was the ideal time to, to start renovations. We had done some um, renovating in our old home. Um, we did, uh, we had the basement renovated. Um, and it wasn't a bad experience. It was just, we always had people coming and going. It was just a lot of dust and it was just, it was busy. We were lucky to have my dad um, who kind of played the role of coordination with all the, the um, uh, subcontractors and all of that. So we were lucky, but we knew this time, like my, obviously my dad was older, couldn't do it, but, uh, and it was a much bigger job that we wanted to do. Um, so uh, we knew that we needed some support, um, but we didn't, we didn't have any negative thoughts about renovating. We just knew it was gonna be very daunting. So there was some fear that of that, of the pressure of, that it would take and the, the toll it would put on us and whether or not we'd survive it, we, <laughs> our marriage would survive it, so. It did. But it did, in the end. <laughs> yeah. but we knew we needed a designer because like John said, we had spent uh, a number of years here, um, but when we first bought the house, we knew we had to get a feel, right? What we needed, what would work for us, and then we'd gone through COVID, right? So we, we knew we wanted someone to come in and kind of help us work through all of the ideas that we had. Um, and a friend of hers was already in the design process with Sazna and she says, oh, they're, she, my friend is doing this, she's with them, she says they're really great. And they referred us and that was it. We actually didn't even get go with anybody else. We just, uh, we, that's, we met you guys and then kind of, that was it from there. When we met Andre, we, we, we heard great things about Sazna and Andre kind of went through our, you know, our thought process, what we wanted to do. Um, he basically questioned everything and, <laughs> and I think he probably asked the question why, like, thousand times yeah. um, so we're a little unsure if you even wanted our business but um, <laughs> I think we're kind of, he was just trying to fill us out and to see if we're serious about our renovations and what yeah. we truly wanted um, and um, and I thought that was a really good experience because it, it actually um, made us think about a few things and I think we kind of changed some ideas based on that discussion as well so yeah. um, it, we ended up at the end of the day uh, feeling really good about that meeting um, and we and we knew at that point we actually wanted to proceed with with Sasan. And then we had talked to people, it was funny because after we had started the process, um, a, lo a few number of people, actually more that work with him, had done had worked with you guys with Sasna in the past. Um, and so we talked about that and they giggled because they're like, yeah, that's Andre and that's how, you know, that's, that's the process, but he really does that to get a good feel and just to make sure it's gonna be a good working relationship. So that, uh, yeah, it's really good. But the design process wasn't as difficult as I thought it was gonna be. I was kind of scared of it, um, just based on experiences I'd have when I got was engaged and when I had to choose everything for our bridal shower registry, was, I was like petrified, so I thought it was going to be similar, um, but it was actually a pretty amazing. Um, it was, um, Chantal really worked with us um, and really tried to understand like the things we wanted, what we were looking for, how we would use the space and was able to translate everything um, that we had said into some pretty amazing designs, actually pretty well the first time yeah, we got, on. pretty bang on actually, the first time. So that was uh, pretty amazing. And then uh, being able to see it in the 3D was even more exciting, you know? Like we changed hardly, probably hardly anything, yeah, right? Very few very things. Few yeah. things. Um, so it was, it was pretty amazing to have that connection uh, right away. Um, so we were very, very pleased with the whole process. We actually moved uh, out uh, the construction process. So we, we um, had uh, uh, left a space to Sazna, um, and um, you know we had a great experience from from the beginning. Um, you know we met prior to the construction phase just to kind of discuss um, how we wanted to be in communication, if we wanted, you know, uh, what kind of updates we wanted, um, and and then once we left the house over to. I think we had one of the most amazing people here in Gus and um, I love and, Gus. <laughs> and he basically took care of this place like it was his own so um, he called us on a daily basis almost uh, kind of just communicating what was going on um, and it was awesome we, we you know we initially thought we'd come here on a daily basis just to make sure everything was okay mm -hmm. and we kind of felt uh, you know a lot better throughout the entire process and we maybe came once uh, once a week or every couple of weeks just to kind of meet up with Gus but other than that we felt pretty comfortable with uh, mm -hmm. with the entire construction phase and not being here and it was so clean 
Um, I remember coming and thinking, you know, it would be a disaster area, but even from, first of all, we were shocked construction was going to start on day one. Um, but, um, we thought, oh, you know, we have a start date, we'll be out, but we weren't sure, but things were moving like from day one, like we saw, we could see progress, um, in the house, but it was just so organized in here. I think that was another one of the pieces that we thought we came in, it was safe. We didn't feel like it was unsafe if we needed to come to visit the home. Um, it was clean. Um, and uh, just just all those pieces. So you knew not just Gus, but the entire team was treating that the, the house as if it was their own. Um, and we got so many comments from our neighbors, just like, you know, the crew's so great, they're so respectful, they're so quiet. And I don't even how they knew how clean you guys were because they're like, oh, and it's so clean and organized. Like, I was just like, were they in the house? You know? But they just, the way things were moving, they just knew that it was uh, it was different than anything they'd seen before. There was the two issues the issues that went that we had to deal with was that the the floor and the family room and the kitchen weren't level and so we had to build up the family room so we ended, ended up having to size that out to put the extra plywood underneath um and that was great we addressed it right away made a decision right away have pros and cons so that was actually really good and then the pocket door oh yeah in the office um that we had planned for just wasn't possible just based on the like, once the walls were opened right it just wasn't it didn't but then we had again alternate solution we put the door in so everything was fast dealt with and didn't delay anything yeah. schedule was done up front um, we stayed on schedule from the beginning um, and everyone everyone at Sosna the entire team everyone we met with uh, from Andre to Chantel to Gus to the entire team um, even the uh, subcon uh, I don't know if they're subcontracts but the people that came through all the people that came through the house everyone we talked to was super friendly um, polite, uh, took care of the place. This place was immaculately clean for, for doing a full, mm -hmm. full, full renovation. So um, that, that really was impressive for us that we knew from the beginning, like we, we never had a doubt in the mind that we, we didn't make the right choice. Mm -hmm. And having a process background, like my, my career's process for the most part, for 20 years, I, <laughs> I liked the, you know, there was a, like, you know, forms and there was a clear understanding by everyone kind of what needed to be done. Um, and the process was followed to a T, to the point where when we made decisions, Gus would make us sign the back of, of wood just to say, hey, you agreed to that, you know? <laughs> so it's just kept everything really kind of straightforward and clear, so communication was really, yeah, it was, great. Uh, was really great, and that was, uh, that's really important. We got two kids, and uh, I think we had three people sharing one bathroom uh, prior to the renovations. <laughs> um, so we got one of the kids using their own bathrooms now. Um, so that's awesome. Um, and then obviously this, you know, just the extending the kitchen, making, you know, um, this just works for us as a family. We have, you know, we, we have a big family and we, now we're able to kind of have everybody in one room and share the space together. We can open our kitchen table, the entire yeah, extension. Yeah, it's like, we can get everyone in here. It's, everyone has a great time. We've had so many compliments from our entire family mm -hmm. on, on the design and on, on, on the renovation. Um, we had a, we previously had an office, uh, a dining room functioning as an office, and kind of kind of just collecting junk and um, just didn't look you know awesome. So that you know the office we created has just been um, absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, so I think that's my favorite, my wife's favorite room. Mm -hmm. um, so um, it, you know it's it's just it's it works. It yeah, is great. so much storage. That was probably the other piece, right? Like we have more storage than we need. Um, which is a good thing and sometimes not such a good yeah. thing because you forget where you put stuff, but, um, but that's another great aspect is that we have lots of space to store stuff. Thank you, Saza, so much for everything. Um, you took our home and you made it into even more of a home for us and we're so grateful to you and to the entire team. Um, like we said, from Andre to Chantal to Gus to Rosie to Roman, everybody, uh, we really appreciate you and look forward to working with you again. Yeah, thank you so much.